What's up, good people? Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. Hope everybody's having a great Thanksgiving. It has been raining cats and dogs. Look, it, here's one of them right here. Leroy. What's up, Leroy? Um, getting ready for Thanksgiving. If you're traveling, please be safe out there. Um, you know what? The shit we do as a parent. So, my daughter, Michaela, has this thing about being in different places that she says she has to sage it. So, she gets some dry sage and set it on fire and it just smoked the place up. So, there was, they were out of it at the Walmart where we live, so we had to go to Charlottesville in the rain. We've got like two inches of rain coming down today at night to get some sage so she can sage the house. She said, there's spirits in here. They're attacking her. Okay. They ain't bothered me. They ain't bothered me. Now, the Eagle fans, now that's a different story. Maybe we can get some sage for the Eagle fans. That, you know, there you go. Burning that green sage. Well, it's actually kind of a whitish green. But be that as it may. Le Leroy thinks he's driving. Okay. Le Leroy, you drive? Okay. We're sitting in the parking lot. So, Dak Prescott was laughing today about, and says he understands about being a fan and how people get angry. Angry! At you. You know? They get angry. Um, you know, about wins and losses and things like that. Um... Especially when they put money on the games. He definitely says he understands that one. Well, he better not understand that one. He better not be gambling because we know how the NFL rules are on this stuff right now. But, you know, basically he's trying to tell you, don't gamble on football then. Never bet more than you can afford to lose, y'all. Words to live by. Um, big game. I know it doesn't seem like a big game, but for me, I'm going to say, I'm going to say that this phone is heavy. Holding this thing up in the air like this is, is hard work. Um, but what, what do you see? What, I'm, I'm trying to see, what, what do you see, Leroy? I see dead people. Leroy? Leroy? Leroy. He got his head on a swivel. For me, I look at it this way. This is the problem we have. We have a circular firing squad with like, you know, uh, Seattle and um, San Francisco. One of them's going to knock each other out. And now that Geno Smith is hurt, that hurts the chances. And this is going to bother me to say this. But right now, the Eagles need to lose. No, that's not that's not our people. The Eagles need to lose more games than I think they're going to. I think we're going to beat them. I think we're going to beat them. I think they might lose to San Francisco. And that gives them two, but then they need to lose another one. And you got the Giants twice after that. I don't know that we can catch them. So I hate to say that this 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 is going to be crazy because, I, I, I truth be told, in the playoffs I I don't know if we can get over the hump for San Francisco. They just seem to have our number. I would rather play the Eagles in Philadelphia than to play the 49ers in in, in San Fran. So what we may need to do, oh my God. This goes against everything I have and everything I am. Okay, hold up. What I was about to say was bad enough. 
So now that we got the sage, which apparently is a couple of sticks, drove 20 some miles in the rain. And I'm like, okay, we can go back. I can go back and do my work that I need to do. And then I hear, oh, this is TJ Maxx. So we can go get some towels and curtains. Oh, no. <laughs> no. So it's bad enough. I got to go to TJ Maxx, but I got to babysit the dog. And I got a cramp in my ass. Back to what I was saying. We may want to root for the Eagles. I threw up in my mouth. I don't think we can catch the Eagles. I don't think we can catch the Eagles. And you really want the Seattle Seahawks to win the division. Or San Francisco wins the division and they're not the number two seed. It sucks. We could end up with the second best record in football and end up having to play on the road. Yeah, but if we're going to play on the road, I'd rather play someplace we're familiar with and we've had some success than going to Santa Clara. It's not even in, it's not even in San Francisco. It's about 40 miles south. Yeah, you tell me what y'all think. Do we root... For the Eagles over the 49ers? I'm sitting in a car in the rain while my wife and my daughter are at TJ Maxx. With a cray cray dog who can't sit still, literally can't sit still. Leroy, 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 don't nobody listen to me, I'd like to know y'all's thoughts, <sighs> be safe out there on the road, I'm Mark Holmes, and this is Leroy, 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 hey, Leroy, talking to you, say hello to, hey, I guess no respect, Leroy, hey, say, I was trying to get him to say hello, he must be mad because I was talking about rooting for the Eagles, peace.